just too many gun ballots going on around here. These people put this in the raw people's hands and people thinking they're clay toys, they're not. As it takes people like, we killed my son. That was Latoya Edwards, the mother of 16-year-old Cassidy Johnson, who was shot to death last night in Durham. One of three shootings that took place in the span of two hours. WR's Willie Danley spoke with Mayor Leonardo Williams about programs that he hopes can improve the lives of young people. Willie? Gerald, tackling this issue has been on the mayor's mind long before what happened last night. He says yesterday's shooting showed the need for more resources for young people in this area. Today, WRL spoke to a mother whose son was killed yesterday. She says the community needs support. It's just crazy. I just wanted to stop. I shouldn't have to bury my son. Those are the words of Latoya Edwards, the mother of Cassidy Edwards, who was shot and killed outside his home at McDougal Terrace in Durham. This is the second time my son got shot out on you. The same way, drive by. My baby was shot in his chest. They had to open my baby up to jumpstart his nut. We didn't know how that feel. They cut on my baby. Sweet back in him was safe and this latest shooting was especially painful for her, considering her son's twin brother was shot in the leg just weeks ago. Edwards spoke about feeling a pain no parent should have to experience. But what is being done about the crime involving young people in the area? I spoke to Durham Mayor Leonardo Williams about an initiative he's working on called Durham is Dope. Creating a capacity for uh, these families to be able to tap into, these mentory organizations to be able to tap into. When people in the Bull City buy merchandise with the slogan, Durham is dope, money will go to mentorship organizations and other resources in the area to help black and brown boys who make up the majority of offenders in the Bull City. They are still children. There is still some mother's son, some father's son, some brother's brother, sister's brother. You know, they are still human. They are still Bull City residents. And we cannot stop our efforts until this, this entire culture has shifted. Mayor Williams tells me he won't be creating new mentorship organizations because there are already plenty of them here in Durham. That funding will go towards those existing organizations so they can have the resources to go out into these communities and steer these young people in the right direction. In Durham, Willie Danley, WRL News. Boy, so it's utter despair on that mother and many others like her in Durham and other cities. Thank you, Willie.